So this is a historic evening. Now, remember, this was Israel's third mission to the moon, Chandrayaan-3, which has been a resounding success so far. Celebrations broke out across the nation after the Vikram lander succeeded in making a soft landing on the surface of the moon. Moments after India made its history, the director of the Vikram Sarabhai Space Center, Uni Krishnan Nair, spoke to Vyond. Listen in to what he had to say. Joining us now, a triumphant man, Dr. Unnikrishnan Nair, the director of India's Vikram Sarabhai Space Center. They're responsible for designing and building all the rockets, all the space transportation systems. Sir, how do you feel? Just like you said one week ago, you've done it. Feather like soft landing? Yes, that is what we said at the time of launching LVM-3. LVM-3 has injected the satellite into the exact orbit with the parameters. So the beginning was good. So at that time, I said, if the beginning is good, the ending has to be good. Today, we are seeing the ending. And uh, after that, uh, that is launch vehicle part and also for the Chandrayaan, uh, two parts from Vikram Sarafai Space Center. There are many systems like explosive systems, composite system. So it, the journey has been very phenomenal and the, towards the final phase, that 19 minutes were so exciting and everything was phenomenal and the Chandrayaan is on moon and the, we have gone to a place where other countries have not gone and we are in the southern tip of Chandrayaan, I mean uh, moon, and then moon belongs to us. Okay, sir. So congratulations again on that UN team, ISRO. So you know you're not the type to rest on laurels. You have much, much more ahead. The busiest two years of your lives ahead. Yeah, yeah. We have exciting missions. Uh, we have the mission to Sun, that is called Aditya L1. We go to something like 15 lakh kilometer from here. So that is mission is going to be there in September. We have the Gaganyan, the modern mission is the in-flight demonstration of crew escape system is scheduled maybe end of September or October beginning. So there are so many missions, exciting missions. So, so how is the morale among Team Isro after doing this? Four years of penance and finally you have the result of uh, a wait of four years? You know, there are uh, failures but we learn more from failures. And uh, here also the situation is not different. It has given a lot of data, though it was a failure, partly failure, because the orbiter is still working and we have established co communication with the lander and the old orbiter. But then that huge data was useful in analyzing and finding out where exactly we went wrong and we ruggedized it, tested and then gained confidence. And then the proof is now there on the moon. Okay. Sir, as we speak, the moon has also risen over Bangalore. India's stations will be tracking, uh, you know, Chandrayaan-3. India's antennae will be tracking Chandrayaan-3 from the deep space network in Bailalu. So tell us, uh, what can we expect over the next 14 days? No, they mostly, you know, they uh, will have the rover out. We'll have the experiments. we get the data, data analysis. So it's going to be very exciting. We may, like uh, last time, you know, Chandrayaan-1 detected water. We will just see that data and then bring out surprises. Let us see what is in store at moon for us. Poll for India. That's Dr. Unnikrishnan Nair speaking exclusively to Beyond World is One with video journalist Chandrasekhar from Bengaluru, Siddharth MP, Beyond World is One. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.